Hey guys, we're out here at 7509 White Boulevard. This is in the back of Mesquite Forest. So it's on the corner, but it's really quiet back here since it's not near either main road. Two car garage. They got a nice big tree in the front yard. Gutters on the front, just so you don't get downpoured on walking through here. And in the house, say hi, mom. Hi. <laughs> it's got ceramic tile floor in the main living area. Really nice, durable, waterproof. Pretty open living room into the kitchen, into the dining room here. Love that big bookshelf that's built in. And you have laundry room here, decent size. Some extra storage space. That's the control panel for the irrigation system. Two car garage has more extra space right here. There's a slop sink, some shelving, plenty of space for a toolbox, workbench. Two car garage. The house is pretty original with the exception of the floors. They definitely painted it since it was new. Tile counter in the kitchen. I call those the number two pencil cabinets because they look like a number two pencil. Small corner pantry here. It does have stainless steel. Sorry about that, my phone froze while taking that video. So I'm not sure if it froze before or after I showed the pantry here. Stainless steel appliances, original cabinets. It's got this breakfast nook here. It's a small space and it's made to feel even smaller with that big table. And that big, I don't know, what do you call that? Bean bag, I guess. But you can have a cute little round table in there or put a baby gate across it and have baby jail. I mean, baby playroom. <laughs> Coming back through here. Let's go in the backyard next. So it's got this extra patio added on. Really nice, good size backyard. There's a storage shed on a concrete slab over there. Um, a tree. The fence is in so-so condition. It's not totally fallen over, but they got some dogs next door. You can see board bent, some rotted boards there, one board missing, a section that's kind of monkey leaning. So if you were to buy this house, I would imagine that you'd be doing a fence at some point. The roof looks okay. Gutter on the back, that's nice. So all the bedrooms are down this hallway to the right. There's a coat closet here by the front door. Let's check that out. I mean, looking at this closet, I just noticed, I don't know if you can tell on video, but the door is not level in the door frame as if maybe the house had settled a little bit. Alarm panel there. It's got old school, I don't know what you call that type of carpet. It's like almost commercial grade carpet. Walk-in closet here. This bedroom here. This one also has a walk-in. A little walk-ins, but definitely walk-in. Hall bath here, original as well. Primary bedroom is a really nice big room. It's got this extra space over here. So the house has a few things going for it, good and bad. I love the space. There's a lot of stuff that I notice, like very DIY type of work on things and it needs updates. And they already have an offer on the table, so we need to decide quick. I like the walk-in shower, that's pretty spacious. The closet here is decent. Not huge, but definitely decent space. And then potty. All right. Well, that's this house, guys. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.
Say bye, Don.